Okay. So uh, maybe you can just play something. So now you can feel uh, kind of this relationship between the ground and your head. Right there, you see on your... Yeah, there you got that uh, atlas occipital joint mm -hmm. in there. That's where the backbone is going right into the, the mm -hmm. skull, so you can feel that. And if you turn around that, see that's a very, very efficient movement. Yeah. And when you have that energy going up, you can let the, your entire back follow that up. Basically. Great. I feel more and more now that you're you're sending your leg out. I don't know if you feel more centered. You feel more centered. Mm -hmm. okay. Yeah, I, I definitely feel like you have the center, and now you're you're sending mm -hmm. your leg out right down to your mm -hmm. toe, and I can feel that actually. Mm -hmm. And my toes feel more relaxed. Yeah. And can you stand up like that? Right, you can. Yeah, actually, you can. Is that okay? Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's a kind of new way of standing up. <laughs> yeah, like feeling it from your center. You can feel that. Kind of, yeah. yeah. And just like a lot of flexibility in your hips and It feels like you're just unrolling something. Yeah. You know? yeah. That's free. Okay. So even here, you can mm -hmm. move, you see? Mm -hmm. You can move, you can move, you can move, you can move, you can move. And then you're sitting already. So mm -hmm. yeah. Direct all the way to your fingertips. Mm. Okay. Here you're still directing, you see that? Mm. Okay, cool, mm. that's cool. There you got my ground, mm. and you got your center. Mm -hmm. So you figure out like how the joints need to be, mm. what kind of state they need to be in for mm. your arms to move uh, effortlessly. <laughs> yeah, you don't have to do so much work. <laughs> so yeah, take a moment to see if you feel any different. Not you. you can. <laughs> then we can play a little bit more yeah. music with the music. changes the way you communicate. Yeah. So we'll, we'll try, we'll push that even further. Yeah. We try different things and not everything is gonna be useful for you, but mm. at least it's interesting to try. Actually there I felt less tension in my shoulders. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because when you're, when you're, you know, when you're in, your gaze is fixed, uh -huh. um, you're actually putting the brakes on with your mm. muscles. The, there are some notes uh, that are kind of unexpected. Mm. Like, the music is going somewhere, and we all think we know where it's going, and then, ah, it, it's like a surprise note. So make sure that I'm with you for that, too.
Is that we're working with um, habitual patterns, mm. so that if I see that you're habitually looking right there when you play, mm -hmm. I'm gonna want to disrupt that mm. because um, your your patterns are really familiar to you, and then once we take away yeah. the, what's familiar, mm -hmm. it opens up new new worlds of possibility, basically. Yeah. So I would say, it. yeah. But yeah. So thanks for taking part thanks in this, a lot. and then we'll, we'll continue do. next time. Yeah. With Viola Gamba next time, or? As you wish, I mean, whatever, whatever you wish.